Hi. Hi, Lexi. Hi, Gus Gus. Hello, Gus. Hello, Gus. What are you doing? Hmm? You going to tell me about your day, Lexi? You going to tell me about your day? How you doing? You watching the stocks? <laughs> oh, you guys. These two, I'm telling you. <laughs> this is how I get greeted every single time. Every time. Huh, Gus? Huh, Gus? Yeah. Hi, welcome to the final day of Vlogtober. I am at my parents' house with the doggies. Lexi. <laughs> Gus, you are literally right on me. I'm allowed to pet Lexi. He gets so jealous and needy. You get so needy. He does. I have done an online workshop for copywriting, which was really interesting this morning. And then I immediately got on the road. I had to make a return to Dress Barn, so that was good. And then I popped over to Marshall's. I did get one thing, I will show you later because it's on the other side of the room now. Um, and then I got a few other bits that I'm saving for a holiday decor haul a little bit closer to Vlogmas. I'm just gonna be collecting things throughout the month of November. And then I went to Target because we needed more Halloween candy for tonight. I'm not staying for all of trick-or-treating because I don't wanna stay that late, but I am here for dinner. I've got myself a Starbucks. So I'm going to, the dogs are, I don't know that the dogs are gonna let me get up, are you gonna let me get out? No. Gus is like, this is where you're stuck. I do need to, it's almost 12.30, so at one I will need to get up and get my laptop and get set up in case anyone emails me. But I might snuggle with these guys for a few minutes and then, don't give me that look, Lexi. She just looks so grumpy. <laughs> he looks so grumpy. <laughs> Sweet little girl. She just wants love and attention. She's just not as needy and desperate and begging for it like Gus is. Huh, Gus? Yeah, so I'm going to get to work in a couple minutes. I've got some more drafts to look at and some more emails to reply to. That's pretty much all I'm doing today. Just working on stuff. Just hanging out with the pups. That's all we're doing. Mom's home. She's working from home today, but she's in her office with the door closed. So these ones will cuddle with me as long as her door is closed. So, yeah, don't ya? Okay, say goodbye for now. <laughs>
it's the end of the day and the end of the vlog and the end of vlogtober and I'm not gonna lie <laughs> I will be kind of glad tomorrow night when I don't have to edit a video <laughs> but I've done pretty well usually I hit editing burnout about three quarters of the way through and I feel like it's just been the last like three three nights that I've ended up putting editing off until the next morning and yeah so just probably gonna happen again tonight to this vlog I had a good day just basically hung out on the couch with the dogs watching TV and reviewing drafts watch Doctor Who from Sunday night it was very good I'm loving the season so far mom made a roast so that was delicious and then trick-or-treaters started arriving before I left I wanted to show you what I got at Marshall's um, I mentioned that earlier I'm not showing you everything because some things I got three things at Marshall's and one thing at Target that I'm saving for a Christmas decor collective haul because I'm gonna be just purchasing and collecting things throughout November probably because I can't really afford to do one big haul but I love Christmas and I love Christmas decorations so I cannot control myself and oh my gosh Marshall's had so much so there are other things that I know I'm going to want but I just have to like space it out and budget it for each paycheck to do a little bit so there will be a collective haul coming towards the end of November but one of the items I bought was not a Christmas thing, so I thought I would show you. I was in the clearance section of Marshall's, back in the homeware section of Marshall's. Um, so essentially home goods, because they're all the same thing. And I found this folio from Bando Stationery. I love Bando stuff. I've seen notebooks and planners with this I am very busy thing. Um, and it's in holographic writing, which I love. That's awesome. And you unzip it, and inside it's got pockets on both sides. So we've got pen pockets and smaller pockets and slots, as well as some bigger pockets that you can put papers and stuff in. Um, so it's pretty cool. And it also does, even with the pens and stuff, it does fit my laptop in here. So I can put my laptop in here, I can put my bullet journal in here, or my lesson plan notebook, or my freelance notebook, so I can use it for just about anything I want. I'm pretty excited about that. $16, it was only $16. It was down from, the Marshalls tag says, compare at 29, and then when it first came to Marshalls, it was $19.99 clearance for 16 but on the back side you can see the original price was $45 so I got it for two-thirds off thought that was cool so I'm very excited about that I'm gonna take that to school with me tomorrow I will use it to hold my laptop um, in my work bag so yeah I will probably vlog some clips of the rest of the night but I will probably say good night to you myself now it's about 8 o'clock I'm really tired I'm just gonna I don't even know if I'm gonna watch a movie. I might just go get <laughs> I might just go get in bed and watch something on Netflix. I started watching the new version of Sabrina the Teenage Witch. I think they're calling it The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina now. It's actually pretty good. I'm really liking the cast. The show is funny but still dark. Or rather it's dark but still funny, so like it's not too dark. There is still some humor to it, but it does feel much more adult than the 1990s it was 90s version of Sabrina the Teenage Witch. I've got a couple pieces of Halloween candy that I snagged from the trick-or-treat bowl at the house. Um, so I might just make myself a glass of elderflower press A. So this is the end of Vlogtober. I do not know what is happening with the content for the next several days because this will go up on a Thursday normally I have a video on Friday um, but I don't have anything filmed yet and I kind of feel like since you've just had 31 videos you might be okay with not having a video on Friday uh, it might give some people a chance to catch up so I will probably pop back up with a video on Monday and just start fresh next week. 
back on the Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. There will probably be some kind of vlog next Wednesday, but it obviously won't be a full weekly vlog because Vlogtober went up through Wednesday and you've already seen what my average Thursday is like four times this month. So I don't know that I really need to vlog tomorrow. So I might leave the vlogging camera at home tomorrow, but I will probably vlog maybe Sunday going to Zinc or maybe Friday, Saturday, Sunday, just put together a small vlog of the beginning of November. But then next week we'll be back to like the regular weekly vlog kind of routine. So it'll take a few days, but we'll eventually get back onto the Monday, Wednesday, Friday and weekly vlogs on Wednesday and all of that stuff that is normal and typical. We'll revert back to regular programming for a month and then Vlogmas will be here. I, I, you know, Vlogtober is nearly done and I am definitely having a bit of the editing burnout, but walking through Marshalls today and the holiday section, I am so ready for Christmas and Vlogmas and all of that. So. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to go get cozy and relaxed and enjoy the rest of my evening. So if you have been watching this month, thank you. Whether you've commented on every video or every other video or have mentioned on Instagram or Twitter that you've been watching, or if you've been completely silent but have been watching, thank you to you all for watching and for liking the videos and being a part of Vlogtober and sharing sharing this month with me. It's been really nice having you be a part of my October. I look back at this month and like, I pierced my ears and we went to Sierra Vista and Bisbee and you've seen what my life is like as a instructor. I think you guys really got some, got a good perspective of what my life with this new schedule and teaching a 5-5 five, five load and the grading, like, it, it definitely, I really do think you've kind of gotten to see what my life is like now, post-PhD, and I still have so many thoughts and so many things about that that will probably be in a future video. It, it really has been great having you be a part of the month. I have loved sharing it with you, and thank you for watching and following along. If you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed Vlogtober in general, I would really appreciate it if you would give this video a thumbs up. Say hi in the comments. Let me know what your favorite part of Vlogtober has been or what your favorite part of your October has been. I love getting to talk to you guys in the comments and hear more about your lives and how you guys are doing. Vlogging months like this are great because I get to talk to you much more frequently and I love hearing how you guys are doing. Leave a comment or say hi over on Instagram or Twitter and let me know how you're doing. I will probably throw a few clips on after this of the rest of the night, but I am going to say goodbye. So thank you for watching and I will see you all soon in whatever the next video ends up being. <laughs> Bye-bye.